Along Highway 99 and Federal Way, you'll find some of the fastest inline skaters in the world at Patterson's West. There we go, now you look like a speed skater. Over the past four decades, Team Extreme has won hundreds of national titles and produced several Olympians. Makes me pretty proud. Mike Patterson started up the rink in 1979, and now his son Darren is in the family business as well. The skating rink environment in the area is very strong, so there was a lot of skaters around. So the local competitions were always very strong, um, and that just, the numbers rose and, and the talent came from that. And in time, we just kind of built a tradition and a foundation of winning, and you know, the athletes just kind of followed from there. Three-time Olympian Casey Boudier, the legend Apollo Ono, three-time Olympian Joey Mantia, Aaron Tran, and three-time Olympic medalist J.R. Selsky. They all trained right here at Patterson's West. My roots, where I learned how to skate, you know, blood, sweat, and tears, ups and downs, and it's really my foundation in the sport of speed skating. It's a hotbed for skaters that became an Olympic breeding ground. The facility is amazing. Team Extreme coach Miguel Jose. The Patterson family has done a really good job over the years of bringing kids through that facility. And once you create an environment where you have so many good people, um, the numbers aspect really helps carry, right? So you get 10, 10 20 kids that are ultra competitive. Um, it's just hard not to create the next, you know, Apollo or JR. It's, it just happens. And Corey Stoddard just happens to be next in line. Everyone who ends up skating there become to their fullest potential. And look at Stoddard extend that lead. Like those before her, Stoddard transitioned to the ice since there's no inline at the Olympics. But she credits her training at Patterson's West for helping her reach her Olympic dreams. I feel like some teams, they do a lot of drills, but not like a lot of racing. And at our practices, it was always racing. And that's the whole point of the sport is racing. The more racing experience you get, the more you learn and the better you get.